once again, all my friends are in need of help. Uh, I don't remember what the actual quest button hotkey is. But, I mean, Sebastian doesn't need help right now, but considering how the last event went, I think it's going to be a bit before he decides to trust me again. Something about not liking all goblins for reasons. I'm not even sure if Anne was cursed by a goblin. We're just assuming that because there were goblins there. But considering, you know, Ranrock and Rookwood are working together, it could be any amount of combinations. Anyway, let's go warp over to where Poppy was waiting, and she was, like, outside of Hog... She wasn't even outside of Hogsmeade. She was in the Forbidden Forest. Uh, what was it? Oh, that's Jackdaw's tomb. I have to go further than that. All right, that's rather new. Oh, yeah, there's more fires out in the Forbidden Forest. And... Oh, there are toads out there. I don't really need more toads. I could use a unicorn. Not mooncalf. Unicorn. Look, there they are. Uh, what else did I need? I needed phoenixes. I don't know where to get a phoenix. But... Anyway. Oh, and I still need... No, actually, I don't need, uh, what's it called? The... Uh, whoopers. I got, I got a bunch of whoopers. Leeches. That's not that far. But Poppy, why did you want to meet me in like the middle of Britain Forest? That seems terribly unsafe. Hang on, where is this? I want this. Who's there? Bring it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. There it is. So the first two attacks didn't have attack indicators. I was waiting for that to depulso. Cheated me. I was I ready for the depulso, and then it didn't give it to me. I was waiting on the marker, and he just didn't care. Oh, I see it. Okay, there's that one, there's that one, and then there's... Huh? One... Two... Where's the third one? That'd be at least three, right? Alright, in the first place, that's... Good for you. In the way. Really? There we go. It's one... Rebellion. Two... Three. Down there. Okay. So... Fireball! Fireball and fireball. That one didn't light, did it? Where'd it go? It didn't light. Why didn't it light? Why are you cheating me out of this? All right. Whatever. Definitely hitting it before. Confringo. Not so tricky after all, Merlin. It wasn't tricky, it was just annoying. Alright, back to finding Poppy. He's 100 meters away. Well, that looks man-made. I don't want it. Back to the lake. Right, we're gonna. Right, we're in the Ferdinand Forest because we're looking for centaurs. That's why we're here. That's why she wanted to meet me in the very dangerous place. Makes a lot more sense. Poppy! There you are. See you. You okay? You should have waited for me. I can do this. They will want to help. Honestly, you should have waited for me. So I can go with you so you don't sit out here on your own. That's super dangerous, girl. Although I think I've established you only think things about halfway through. So we should work on that. Is this where we're meeting the centaurs? Well, they don't exactly know we're coming. So it's less of a meeting and more of a surprise, I suppose. There's that halfway thinking again. 
They won't like this. I'm not sure about this. I can't imagine they're fond of being surprised. We don't have a choice if we want to help the Snidgets. I know, but perhaps they'll think be things able through, please. To tell that we're sincere. There's something about them that's so knowing. It's almost unnerving. Uh, they are known for being wise. I suppose they are known for having an air of omniscience. That's exactly the right word. I just... never mind. What is it? It's nothing, truly. I've... we've no secrets to hide. What are you That's hiding, right. Poppy? We'll simply be honest with them about what we're trying to do. They'll have to help us, won't they? I sure hope. Yes, of course. You're absolutely right. We'll meet with them, tell them about the Snidgets, and I'm sure to all be fun. Is an arrow going to come out of nowhere and, like, almost hit us? Oh, no, just a stampede of them. Hi. We come in peace. Poppy, do you know about Centaur Tradition? How do we, like, bow to them without them, like, beheading us? What do you think you're doing here, humans? Please. You guys are very cool. We were hoping to speak with you. Ah, I suppose you'd like a tale for your friends of the time you spoke to a centaur and it spoke back. No, 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 no. no. Never. We're here because we need your help. Enough. You made a grave error in judgment in coming here, Please little Please listen witch. and talk with us. Please, negotiation. Leave them be, Alec. We do not harm the young. Oh, yeah, that. It is not our way. You forget your place, old fool. I'm the leader of this herd, and while you cling to our way, their kind continues to slaughter beasts like us without a care. From what I can see, they have slaughtered no one. I mean, I've slaughtered they goblins, but here that's different. Unharmed. I like how you called him old, but you're the one with Mark the beard. Mark my words, Doran. If I ever see them again, it will be all three of your heads. How did you become herd leader? With that attitude? Doran, can you lead the pack? That seems a lot better. Foolish children. Do you know what happens to wizards who wander here? That's why we're risking this. Because now, we know. Follow me before Golden I... Snidgets are still alive, and the poachers are after them. They know that the key to finding them lies in the moonlight, but they don't know what that means yet. Please help us find the Snidgets before the poachers do. Could it be? In the south, there is a cave within which lies what the poachers seek, a moonstone. Retrieve it and place it in the henge in the forest. I, on the other hand, must go speak with the herd. Find me after you have done this. Okay. That worked, I guess? I don't understand. So the moonlight mentioned in the journal doesn't refer to actual moonlight, but to a moonstone. I have a lot of moonstones. What do moonstones have to do with snidgets? And why... Was he so certain about where we could find one? Did he help your grandmother before? <laughs> Isn't moons are common? I've got a whole bunch just in my pocket. Isn't Moonstone all around us? Why retrieve one from a cave? Knowing centaurs, I suspect he's referring to a specific Moonstone. We'll likely know it when we see it. I sure hope so. But he knows things, so let's follow I it. don't know, but I am inclined to believe him. What with his being a centaur and all. I am too. It is a shame how quickly he left. What was his name? Doran. That's what the leader of the herd called him. Well, if Doran knows something we don't, I'd rather act now and ask questions later. You do I can that head a lot. to the library and start looking into the cave you mentioned. I'll okay. let you know what I find. Just don't stress out too much. Let me help. It's fine. There's there's a table here. Oh, look, Moonstone. Where's this table? Where's that? Have I used this? He's likely studied here. Have I used this? I haven't. Let's go. Before the sun comes up. Uh. 
Oh, like this. Yes, I see it. Zoom it out. Almost there. Come on. Draco. Done. Uh, what's this one nearby over here? Hippogriffs? I mean, I don't need more hippogriffs, but I'll go find them. Oh, look at them! I need to actually put the bag on. There we go. Let me it's okay, I'm rescuing you. I I find it really funny that it just ragdolled and fell over after the Levioso. Like, he didn't know how to land. Professor Howell will never believe Revelio. Who's this over here? Oh, Dogos. Yeah, that's what I thought. I couldn't depulse you again, but I could descendo you. I mean, I already have High Wing. Rebellion. What else is around? What was that? Was that a screen tear or was that string? Must have been a screen tear. Alright, there's a Merlin trial over here, but there's also dudes. Come to think of it, months ago I had a brooch. Nice it was. Sparkled like the glint in my What is he eye. doing? You can feed a beast or it can feed you. If you get my meaning. Uh, freeze a stalker. Stop while ready to send Oh, too late. Endo. You're the little stuff that's great. Stupid. Oh, he died. Your luck. There we go. Oh, you put that up at the last second. No, no. Can I shove you in the wall? Ah, you didn't hit the wall. Oh, you didn't even hit the ground. You bounced off the... The air. Who? Could it be a Merlin trial? Who Rebellion. is targeting me? Oh, it's a butterfly one. Oh, what the Complete the battle into oh. But they're fighting a troll. Poorly. Is the one down here? Basically Confringo. what? Well, they're not out with the dogs, but... Yeah, that battle's not mine. Anyway, let's go... lure the butterflies or whatever. Also, was there anything for me to rescue here? I'll figure it out in a second. Where are the butterflies? There's a set. Lumos. Just go through the thing. Confirm. Fine. You don't have to Lumos. Move the branches out of the way. Where are the butterflies? No, really. Where are the butterflies? Man, I hate this one so much. Oh, there, up there. Okay. There's more there. They're still fighting. Poorly. By the sound of things. Alright, there should be one more. Because it's right there. One more set of butterflies. Is it. Are you behind it? Really? Oh, you're behind it. Lumos. There we go. Money in here. I can't believe they hid the butterflies behind a destructible object, and I can't even Revelio to know that they're behind it. Be Although I guess the uh, block would have prevented me from being able to see it anyway, because it would have appeared blue behind it. Still, annoyed. Don't like it.
You guys done with the troll? Did you win? Apparently I can't hit from here. Really? Rebellion. Anyway, I should go back to do my quests. I got super distracted by hippogriffs and then finding things. Right, 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 right. Anyway, back to Hogwarts for- Oh, there's quests around! Let's see, this was Natty. This is- Oh, the next summoner's court. And this is... Hufflepuff and the Astronomy Wing. Okay. I suppose I've made quest progress to say, hey, there are more quests. Anyway, let me- Let me do this then. Because this should be quick. Should. Being the operative word. There's a chance that I screw it up too many times and it goes poorly. But I haven't lost one yet. Hope they don't jinx it. Hello, who are you anyway? I don't think I've met you. You're a Hufflepuff by the looks of things. Charlotte Morrison. Hello. Hello. Are you here for someone as caught? That I am. Don't expect to be as lucky here as you were in Crossed Wands. Speaking of which, care to lose... I mean, play a match? A smug one, aren't you? Of course, Charlotte. Then may the best summoner win. I plan to. Ooh, was that arrogant of me? Was that... Was that anti... Are those gravity zones and... Do they... Do those bump you? Interesting. Precisely as planned. How come all of mine are like in the worst positions possible for this? I can't get a clean shot anywhere. Okay. Such grace. <laughs> Finesse. Oh, you know what? I hate you now. You kidding me right now? Precisely as planned. Oh, I dislike you immensely. Yeah. <laughs> Sting me with a billy wig. I'll never top that. I need to knock one of hers off. Are you kidding me? What is this perfect play nonsense? Precisely as planned. I can't beat that unless I knock something off. Can I get this cross court? Oh, it's gonna go so poorly. Accurate. I have actually lost this one. Nice technique. I can't help Since but feel like the AI is super cheating. I have inferior position here because I have like all the bad angles. Hard luck. Care for another round? Yes. Absolutely. Don't count me out yet. That's the spirit. All right. Play aggressive, play mean. Go for it. What is that? Precisely as planned. Oh, I hate you a lot. Come on. Accio. Oh, come on, fall off too. Such grace. <laughs> Finesse. I can't. Accio. Oh, I'm I'm manifesting the want to use uh, Crucio, it's bad. Precisely as planned. I wonder, can I slingshot this? Do some fancy work here. Stop! Stop! Oh. Such grace. <laughs> Finesse. This is the worst I've done. I hate this court. 
you're not about the perfect play. What? She has perfect angles to get all three in this corner. I have perfect angles to get into this corner where I'm gonna get bounced away. Are you kidding me? I have no way of getting that to this corner and like punishing her. Oh my God. This is so bad. Such grace, <laughs> finesse. At least it's on the board this time, come on. She perfected me. Are you kidding me? Hard luck. Care for another round? I'm so set up for failure right Absolutely. now. This sucks. Don't count me out yet. That's the spirit. Like, this corner is safe. I can't reach that corner. Are you how? What? Precisely as planned. Akio. Okay, better. <laughs> Sting me with a billy wig. I'll never top that. Akio. Let's see how this goes. Is she gonna bounce off everything and still perfectly get everything in? Are you really? Precisely as planned. It's perfectly outside the range. Really. Nonsense. Nonsense, I tell you. Akio. In the double fifty? Mm, nice technique. Excellent. Akio. Let's see what she pulls off here. Precisely as planned. All right, let's see if I can thread the needle here and pull it through all this and land it in the green. What I can hope for. No, no, no. We good. Mm, I win. Nice technique. Wow, you are good. Yes. It just took for you to... She didn't get a single 50 that time. The game gave it to me. She didn't get a single 50. Last time she got perfect plays, and this time she didn't. <laughs> I'm not too proud to admit when I've lost. Where did you learn to play like that? Intuition. I play by intuition. Natural skill and all that. That's been my strategy. I suppose it only gets you so far, though. It's true. Well, you've only one opponent left now. I won't say more than that, but let's just say he's the best for a reason. Took me, what, four tries to get you? Incendio. Defender. Bombarda. Can bring her. Bombarda. I also just like the Bombarda effects. It looks like I knocked him over. Oh yeah, Bombarda has really cool stuff, though. I like that explosion. It's like purely concussive. There's no fire to it. Oh, really? That's out of range? There we go. Anyway, I'm enjoying that too much. Next. Uh, let me... Let me actually go talk to Natty. She technically has more priority, but someone in this court was right there. And I lost it too many times to make it too quick. Oh, look at the Christmas tree and the Christmas dinner and all that, and it's snowy out. Oh, this is really nice. Got the big tree. Is this even a pine? I guess it is a pine tree. Alright. Why am I... Why am I half in the floor? What is happening? What? The stairs are... Why did that count me as half in the floor? The stairs are over here, anyway. Natty, where were you? Ah, I have been meaning to speak with you. Yes? I still can't believe we escaped the Ashwinders. I believe you it. You may not realize it, but you are the talk of the school since you saved me that day. Wait, how many people I know? how everyone knows about it. I told my mother in the hope that she would be more forgiving of what I have been up to if it came from me. 
She likely told other professors, and <laughs> news travels quickly. Unfortunately, she might, in fact, have been even less forgiving than I'd hoped. You did get captured, and I had to save you. Her concerns is are warranted, yes. I don't blame her for being concerned. We have been involved in some dangerous activities. As the Ashwinders were locking me up and threatening my life, it did occur to me that my mother may have been right. Just a bit, huh? <laughs> Has Officer Singer done anything with the evidence we provided? Probably she no. She has not. Of course. Halo is as strong as ever. Someone needs to stop him, whether it is us or Officer Singer. I have, if someone I have, had stopped mm. the monsters like him in Matabililand, my father would be alive today. What exactly happened to your father? It was a beautiful day. My mother had gone to tend to a neighbor who was ill, and so my father and I were galloping in the savannah. Galloping? Your father was also an Animagus, I take it. He could become the most majestic giraffe, and he would carry me on his back, my arms around his neck. Look, a giraffe is not very we useful as a form. Home when we surprised a group of bandits who had come from our village, one of them saw me just as he removed a scarf from his face. He shouted and then aimed his rifle. He didn't want you to identify him. Exactly. In an instant, my father bowed his neck to protect me and was hit as he fell. My father changed back into his human form. When the bandits saw this, they turned and ran in fear. Magic terrified them, and then he was gone. <sighs> and it was all my fault. Your fault? How so? He died protecting me. If I had been capable of protecting myself, he would still be alive today. My mother and I tried to go on without him, but it became too much for us there. A few years later, we left to come to Scotland. So, what I was trying to say before I stumbled over my own face was I have a Defendo with his name on it, referring to uh, Harlow and whatnot. But, you know, I couldn't let that go normally, so I had to screw it up. Uh, on the other hand, let me get this straight. You were in danger, your father gave his life to protect you, and so in return you... Go out and endanger yourself more. Natty, did you think about this even the slightest bit? You really shouldn't be risking your life if he gave his life to save you. You know that? That's... You're risking what he rescued with his life. Do you think taking down the Ashwinders will avenge your father's death? No. Vengeance is not what drives me. My father would not want that. He, and my mother, raised me to believe that it is a privilege to be able to fight for those who cannot. I know there is risk involved, but I feel it is worth it. <laughs> I am glad you seem to think so, too. I... Mm, I kind of don't. I get it. But... I wish... Ah, you are kids. You are actually 15. So, asking you to think it through may be too much for you. I wish it weren't, but... Yeah. What does your mother think about all of this? Well, as you saw, she worries a great deal. She is an excellent seer, but I think it bothers her to this day that she did not see my father's death coming. She misses him, as do I. So I believe on some level she understands my need to seek justice in a small way, but that does not mean that she likes it. Yeah, that's fair. Do you think your father would approve of the things we've been doing? Oh my, that is a good question. In theory, yes. Although he would worry as my mother does. But I think he, of all people, would understand my persistence. My father never shied away from a fight for good, no matter how ruthless the foe. And I think he would have enjoyed knowing that I had a compatriot like you. Well, that's fine then. I do see why you're a Gryffindor though. That almost reckless courage. I'm sorry, Natty. I can't imagine what you've been through. Your father sounds Where's exceptional. Where's my family? Who's my family? Truly extraordinary. And thank you for your kind words. What's my backstory? We all have our burdens. My father had a saying about that. Yes, I remember. Rain does not fall on one roof alone. Exactly. Soon you and I will put an end to the Ashwinders, beginning with Harlow. And once he is gone, we will turn our attention to Rookwood. 
We are making progress, and we will succeed. All right. Thank you Good again talk. for saving me. You deserve all of the praise you have received. Okay, but everyone knowing that probably isn't great for me. It puts a big old spotlight on me, and I'm not a huge fan of that, considering the spotlight that is already on me. Uh, anyway, about uh, Wells. What is this? All's well that ends... Bell, was it? Wells and Bells? Wheel and Deal? Who's this Hufflepuff? Have I met them before? He's got a hat. Now what am I supposed to do? Your sister has been at St. Mungo's for three days, and she's still vomiting slugs. If you ever point your wand at your family again, mark my words, you will lose that wand. You actually cursed your sister with slugs? Oh, well, I could say that's because you're a Slytherin, but considering how Ron cursed himself with slugs because of a broken wand, you're just stupid. The sheer nerve taking them down. I don't think I know you. Hello. Pardon me, is everything all right? No, no, it's not. Oh, okay. We only had two bells to go. But she just had to go and spoil things. Context, please. I'm afraid I don't follow who spoiled things. Was it what bells? <sighs> Professor Black ordered Mr. Moon to take down the bells in the bell tower. Said they were giving him a headache. <sighs> Those bells are a part of Hogwarts. I wasn't about to let that happen. So I asked my friend Adelaide to help okay, me. Okay, I know them Adelaide. Back. We've always been a duo of sorts Adelaide and Evangeline, Addie and Evie. Anyway. It was going swimmingly until Black started asking questions. Then she wasn't comfortable with our rule breaking. Now I'm stuck, unable to tell which bell goes where. Does he really remove the bells for a headache? This is why he's the worst headmaster in the history of Hogwarts. He's also, I believe, the last Slytherin headmaster until later, but yeah, reputation. He doesn't have one. It's certainly an odd decree, even for Black, taking down the bells for a headache. I agree. I thought it might also have been that they interrupted his hourly naps. That's all he does in his office, you know. But then I heard... Can you keep a secret? Yes. I can. I heard from Alice, who heard from Ollie, who heard from Eugenia, that it's because the bells... reminded him of his wedding day. Breaks out in a sweat every hour on the hour. But mum's the word. I mean, if we're screwing with... Professor Black, uh, I am all in. Is it really that important that the bells go back up? Is it really that important? They're part of the school's history. Those bells likely told a young Merlin that he was running late to charms, or called Ignatia Wildsmith to dinner. We can't simply fiddle with history. We're meant to be its stewards. Fair enough. Anyway, why can't you do it by yourself? If only two bells are left, isn't it fairly easy to tell which goes where? Easy for you, perhaps. I happen to be tone deaf. Oh. Mother likes to say I couldn't carry a tune if it hopped on my back like a chocolate frog. Man, I want a no chocolate frog. No point putting them back in if they don't sound just as they did before, for the sake of historical accuracy. I can understand that. I understand that a lot, actually. I can help. Perhaps I could help put the bells back up. Really? Oh, that would be wonderful. The bells are in the bell tower just above the music room. You're How certainly surprising. of more help than Adelaide. I don't blame her. She's uh that's some rough time. Hey, the bells are just inside. Hey, in how the you bell doing, tower. Sebastian? You you gonna ignore me, Sebastian? Are we not best friends? Okay. Fine. Make me feel bad. I gotta go down this way and around. Let's get to the music room. Gotta go down, then I gotta go up. Nope, out to the courtyard. Ah, now it's loaded. Snowman! I got snowballs! Did, did, did it work? <laughs> you retaliate! What if I do with this? 
Oh, 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 I... I'm so sorry. I'm... I... I wasn't sure if it would, but... I'm... I'm so sorry. I... I'm gonna play nicer. I... I didn't think it'd kill you. I mean... I... I assumed it might, but... Yeah, you're fun of that. Alright, Glacius doesn't phase you, so you don't react to it. You don't react to that. You react to that. You react to that. I'm not gonna set fire to you. Nah, you didn't get transformed. Expelliarmus. Hey. I guess I can't Expelliarmus your body. Ah, uh, you don't get slowed? Don't hit him with fire. No, oh, you don't react to Descendo? Alright, uh, just don't hit him with fire and he'll be fine. You know what? Is this above me? Is this where this is? Because if it's up here and I can get it. I have no clue. Where could this be? Revelio. It's not in here, is it? Hey, stop, stop, stop. Right, shift. Shift is move. Shift is gear. Not a sprint. Landing should be available right here. I should be able to get into this. Alohomora. I'm locked real quick. There it is. Oh, that was quick. Alright, doesn't look like there's a chest in here, but there Rebellion. is a page. Dark Tower Cell. It said that centuries ago, Charms Professor kept a troll here on which students could practice particularly challenging spells. Shocking to be sure, but perhaps unsurprising during a time when Quidditch involved the use of live snidgets. One can only wonder what it may be used for in the future. Dark. They didn't really clean it up after not having a uh, troll up here, huh? Rebellion. Where's... Oh, this is Professor Ronan's room, isn't it? Yeah. Then I have no idea where that chest is. Because it exists on the map, and I don't know where. Anyway, um, I've gotten very far away from the bell tower, haven't I? I've gotten extraordinarily far. I have to go back to the courtyard, don't I? Yep. Take the shortcut down. Shortcut, let's go. Come on. You can jump over. Oh, really? Just let me, just let me jump over. It's fine. My legs will break, but it's fine. I'm I'm a resilient kid. It won't I be that much. I can't believe we found Duncan owes his reputation to you. Ominous, could you finish one sentence before you go on to another? That'd be great. Thanks. All right, now that I'm backtracking, I'm so brilliant. You know what, peeps? You're good in my book. If you're tormenting Professor Black. Revelio. I heard it. Wait, I heard a ding. Where? There are locks for me to open here. And the question is, where are they? Wait a minute. Where are they? I heard some chat near the girls' lavatory about food. Do you think they're looking to brew a polyjuice potion? Where's the old brew? And shops, actually, that Hufflepuff girl with the long arm. That'd be really funny. Oh, Polyjuice Potion. That's it, I actually recognize the ingredient, because I'm like... Well, I mean, I didn't say anything, but... Oh, it's peas. Rebellion. Ding? Oh, up there! Yes, that. Where is that? On the opposite side. 
That's not good. You should probably stop that. All right, well, I can't. Alohomora. Done. Stuff in here. Ooh, there's a... Rebellion. Uh, what's it called? Accio. Not Accio, I wanted Incendio. this. Page, get. Earth Mincy. All right, uh, three. So that's triple head. And then, uh, that's a, again, that's the bottom one. And then that's two, two, ten, so six. Three, four, five, six. So lizard. So lizard, triple head. Lizard. Triple. Also, what's the find me? Action chest. Jack o' lanterns. It's a bit late for that. Ready in winter. Revelio. Ding. How is that possible? Where? Oh, is that upstairs? Yeah, that's possible. Wait, how is that possible? Ah, the bell oh. must be upstairs. I don't think I went up here, did I? I did not, because there's a chest. Oh no, the Aloha more. Aloha more chest. Maybe I did go up here and just find this one, or did couldn't unlock this one before. But I remember finding this room. Because it had the frog choir here. Well, aren't you jolly? Okay, well, there's one of the bells. Ah, found them. I'll have to get those up there somehow. Wingardium Leviosa, perhaps. Yeah, but I gotta find out which bell's which. Are they just different sizes? How did that get there? Also, what's up here? Oh, there's frog portals. Hang on, let me figure this out first. Accio. Wingardium Leviosa. I mean... If it's size, then this one should go here, yes? Okay, well... My fault for thinking it would just attach. God, it went to the bottom. Awesome. Get out here. I thought it would simply repair itself. Because I can't exactly cast Reparo when I'm hovering this. All right, yeah, that's a tiny bell, so that's probably the top one. How do I turn this? How do I move this? Is that it? Is it going to plug in? No. Hello? How do I make it fix? Where'd it go now? How do I turn it? There's gotta be a way to turn this, right? Spin it this way, but I can't spin it the other way. I can make it go up and down. I could have sworn there were other buttons that tell me how to move things. So me not remembering is not helpful. to go. Are you What was I just doing it on the wrong floor? Oh, did it actually go there? Was that I was putting in the wrong place. I just assumed, and apparently I was wrong. 
Well, that wasn't too hard. Evangeline should be pleased about this. It was harder than I made it to Black isn't. Alright, where's everything up here? Is it a chest? Aha! There we go. Wellings. Take me, Frogger. Alright, did you take me across the way? Uh, where did you take me? Oh, orbicular. Uh, was that where I was? Did I, did I miss the big chest right there? Oh, I'm dumb. I'll get on the way back. Well, I guess there's no other way back. Or I, I thought it'd send me somewhere else, but. Oh yeah, that was right there, huh? All right, on between these two. This is a really nice view. You can see the Quidditch pitch. You can see that courtyard. I can, I can't fly from here because this is caged in. Can I jump over? I can't jump over. I apparently get suddenly very less athletic. I can't jump over that. I can drop the bell down the entire tower, but I can't jump down the tower. Fine. So can I play these? Man, if I knew which note was which and I could actually remember how to play music, that'd be really cool. However, I cannot. Therefore, never mind. Have I been in here? That's a no. Didn't expect to see you there. I like don't even need the money anymore. What? Where is this? Where does this go? Rebellion. Oh. Has it always gone there? Oh. Okay. I apparently never took those stairs before. Despite them being right there. Well, I suppose that's on me. Have I let this? There's really no need. Oh, you're just coughing? Alright, apparently that cannot be lit. Uh, I tried. So many Hogwarts mysteries. Actually, there's only three Hogwarts mysteries, but I haven't found the third one yet. I wish they'd let me. And the second one took me two tries to figure out. I can't Sonic roll out. Can't spin dash. Not even here, huh? But Ominous Duncan owes his reputation to you. Uh, you said that already. Ominous, where are you even going? It's a dead end. You know that. Ominous, we're friends now, right? Yeah, another thing with, um... Slytherin House here I is... I can't believe we found ourselves trapped in that scriptorium. Never again. Is, I've actually made friends with both... Ominous and Sebastian. The only Gryffindor I really consistently... Luke and Brattleby must have nearly wet himself when you won every single crossed once battle. Thank you. But yeah, I... Defending Hogsmeade against All right, Ominous, that's enough. I'm trying to talk you know, here. There is such... But yeah, um... Revenge. He... I have multiple friends... Arrogance. ...in Slytherin... Alohomora. ...that have accompanied me. Natty's the only... ...Gryffindor that's really accompanied me. And, uh... Oops. And... Poppy's the only... Hufflepuff. And then Amit's the only Ravenclaw, but I think Amit is... Gone. Rebellion. He certainly cowered it out after our first outing, so... Attention! I've been advised that various members of staff would like to organize a social gathering. I have no objection to this, and will sh and shall leave it to those so inclined to fraternize, ensuring such activities fall outside of school hours, of course, and that nothing so jovial as to disrupt my concentration should occur. Oh, you're so annoying. Likely I should be busy on the date, but will review the invitation when received. I recognize that my absence will mar the engagement. No, it'll improve it. Also, one half of an hour should be sufficient. Really? Half an hour for a little party? And please be mindful that any sort of musical presence would 
strictly be prohibited. Phineas Nigellus Black, Headmaster. P.S. No confectionery shall be served lest they try to stray right or no, you can't even have cake. Please try to limit the number involved in this frivolity to fl Oh my god, you are the worst. Not even just as headmaster, you're just an awful person. You're insufferable. Rebellion. The basket we've read. But why is it a big old brick? Oh, there's a demi guys in here. Oh, over here. It's this. Is this? Bogart closet. Ah! This old cupboard is said to have once contained a powerful bogart that five professors working together would could barely repel as it shifted among werewolf, tornado, plate of haggis, Hungarian horntail, and someone's mother-in-law. Okay, so the werewolf makes sense. They're pretty scary. Tornado? Yeah, tornadoes are terrifying. They'll tear up a whole, like, town. Hungarian horntail. Dragons are large and scary. Someone's mother-in-law. This makes sense. Who's afraid of a plate of haggis? How are you having trouble fighting that? It's a plate of haggis! I mean, sure, it may be disgusting, but... Well, I don't know if it is, but I wouldn't want to try it. Lovely treat to have you walk by. Be sure to pass by at least once a year. Twice, if you can. Okay. Um, but yeah, no, who's having trouble fighting haggis? Which professor was that? Was it Professor Black? Because I can believe that. No, because it's supposed to be ancient. Mind now, Demi. I can't believe you interrupted my mind now, Demi guys. How could you? Anyway, mind now, Demi guys. I don't suppose you're still up here, are you? Waiting for me to report to you? Wait, wait where did you, where did you go? Was it one more floor up? Ah, you are here. Good. I fixed the bells. The bells are back up, Evangeline. Ah, oh, you're a credit to the school. I can't wait to hear them. I can't wait for the headmaster to hear them. I wish I could see his face. Future generations may not truly appreciate what you've done, but I do. And I hope that you do as well. All right, nice. You don't know how much this means for me and for Hogwarts. No problem. I got an, a rump... An, what was that? Horn? But yeah, no, if we're screwing with Professor Black, then by all means... All right, let's go do the main plot because I got nothing else to do. Miss Fitzgerald, was it? Yeah, I gotta go to the map chamber. All right, well in that case, let me hit my uh my place first because I believe I can breed at least like one more. Uh oh, I should also get these identified and sold. Um, let's see, in here, let me see my beasts, uh, I do have the brown hippogriff, whoopers, whoop offspring, giant purple toad, so I need the giant purple toad offspring, and I need whooper offspring, oh no, I have whooper offspring, I need toad offspring, I have so many whoopers now, it's great. Toad. Let me get a brush out. Let me get you before you get over there. That way you can eat in peace. Oops. The brush didn't take it. Now it did. We're still eating. Alrighty. Oh, oh, that's still eating. You have to eat. You have to be brushed. Alright, you have to eat. You have to eat. You're all set. This food was taking so long to eat. Hurry up. I know you're tiny, but come on. Get on with it. Not that one. This one. There we go. Not that one. I keep hitting two, not three. It's okay. It's a brush. Huh. It didn't take the first time. 
Like, it's highlighting Fooper offspring, but the interact button is over on the other Fooper. You need to eat. Go eat. Not that button. There we go. Who still needs to be brushed? I've got a Fooper that still needs to be brushed, and... That's it. Which Fooper still needs to be brushed? I'm missing a Fooper. Is it you? No. You're set. You're set. You're set. There, it's you. I'm always going invisible. I'm not trying to. All right. Anyone else have anything for me? Once this fooper's done. Yep. Once you eat, I'll be set. There we go. All right. Um, how many more did I need to breed? for the neat mask. Not this one. Challenges. Also, I had combat challenges done. Uh, ah! I defeated 100 Dark Wizards. Alright, so I'm done with Dark Wizards. I'm done with Dog Bogs. I'm done with Goblins. I need to fight more Zombos. I need to fight more bosses. And I am halfway done with Spiders. I need 50 more Trolls. I need 9 more Doggos. And I'm done with Dueling Feats. Cool, cool, cool. I need one more. I need... One more animal, because I think I've... How do I check what animals I've got? Not talents. Inventory? That's what I've got now. I have a demi, guys. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do with that now. Uh, Collections. Play this real quick. Maybe not quick, whichever one. I have protective shielding somewhere in here. There it is. Wand handles. I have a bunch. Or was it only two? Uh, this one. Right. The Arumpen horn. Normally filled with an explosive fluid, these horns are highly prized after for their magical properties. Neat. And I just got one. Well, I guess it's hollow. So it's not useful anymore. It's just decoration. Feels like a poacher trophy, though. I don't know if I'd like putting that up while I'm having all my animals, like, here. But decos are decos. Uh, animals. I have all of these. I have ten animals, though, don't I? Diracol... Whooper, Toad, Hippogriff, Jabbernal, Neasel. Is it Neasel I need to breed still? No, it's Puffskeens, isn't it? I don't think I've ever bred a Puffskeen. Let me see if I can fix that. Because if I, if that's the last one, then I should be able to finish this off. Let me look here. Neasel Offspring, Jabernal Offspring, Mooncalf Offspring. I don't think I have a Puffskeen Offspring. Bunch of Puffskeens. Uh, Puffskeens, though. Uh, move to inventory. I'll look after you. And let's see if this will count it. I don't have the proper Puffskeens. Uh, you're both female, that's why. Uh, let's swap you out. You in. That's ten. Excellent. Let me get to brushing while I'm here. Measles are just fancy cats, huh? Oh, 
Which one? Mooncalf. Trying to get the mooncalf here. There we go. Not that bunny. It's three. It's always three. There we go. I can target to get it to work. Oh, you're tiny and adorable. That's not the button. All right, where are the rest of you? I need to still eat. Look at you. I moved you in. You started breeding, and now you're just... I keep hitting the wrong button. That's boating so well right now. Oh, come on. There's the one more there. I see it. Alright, you guys are eating. Get your food. Oh, look at this tiny kid. I'm hitting the wrong button every single time. There we go. You're done. You need to eat. You guys are all set? You're flying out there. Are you all set? You are all set. Uh, all that's left is baby cat and the puff skein. And another Neasel that needs collecting. Oh boy. Is it you? It is you. There we go. Is that. There we go. Now you eat. That's. Where's that puff skein? Is it you? It is you. How'd you eat and then get so far away? Alright. I still need... Unicorns, Grab Horns, and, uh... And Phoenixes, yeah? So I don't think I can upgrade... Oh, wait. Let me equip my new stuff first. So I have new glasses... That are supposedly better. Ooh, 102, 90, 90. I can't use these. Oh, man. Well, that's unfortunate. I was hoping to get upgrading. I mean, I probably still could. But yeah, everything I have, just gonna make sure it's always worse. Yep. Let me upgrade the thing I can't use yet. These glasses? No. These glasses, yes. Let me put my big slicey on it. Go. And then upgrade Jobber Null. Jobber Niffler. Grab Horn Horn. Need a Grab Horn Horn. But it's ready for upgrades. And then I also need. Grab horn. Phoenix feather unicorn. Oh. Phoenix unicorn grab horn. Yep. Those three. Those are the three I don't have. They require the highest level. Why was the animation still going? Anyway, let me put this back in just in case I find. Let me get to Hogsmeade so I can sell junk. Ooh, and I want to put that uh, mask that I got on. I'm going to have to unlock it first. Open. Open says me. Challenges. Remove requirement. Give me that. Alright, so this is just the only one I have left. Is rescue more beasts. It's not even rescue different kinds of beasts. It's just a bunch more beasts. Inventory. Yes. Oh, it looks so good. So cool. Why am I looking away? There we go. Adventure cool guy now. And it fits with the Ravenclaw stuff. I like how this is, aside from the, you know, eagle head. It's symmetrical. It's so clean. So nice. And then it wraps around. 
Ravenclaw aesthetics are the best. Alright, let me find that mask. There it is. Inventory. I got more feathers. Here. Oh, wand handles, of course. I did get two of those. Talents will stay with the little point because I can never decide. I don't even know what talents I still need. You're back. Nice I am back, to see Albie. you again. Here, give me your money. 